Okay, last day, final one. Uh, big conditioning session. Now, I did mention before that we're going to scale it, so I've set a time limit. We've got seven minutes to do each round. So it's three rounds, uh, you've got seven minutes in each round. Um, I'm going to put the uh, program up. It's, you know, you're doing three exercises. <laughs> it's very, very simple. It's just an awful lot of reps, okay? In the region of doing 80 reps, 60 reps, 40 reps. Take a look at the program. Uh, I won't bore you to tears with it now. Just have a look. Um, I will, of course, show you how to do every single exercise, and I will also run you through you know, the time, and I'll have my time, so don't worry about that. I'm not counting for you because I can't. It's proven I can't count for shit. So let me just look at a stopwatch. Can't go wrong there, all right? Um, yeah, so you do as few or as many reps as you can in those seven minutes. So scale it to you, okay? So tailor it to you. Make sure you're not pushing yourself too hard that you're losing form. You go at your own pace. Okay, so two exercises back to back during those seven minutes, three separate rounds. Okay, we are going to finish off with one minute of mountain climbers, as you can see in the program. Uh, I'll put it on the screen so it's here constantly, so you can refer to it constantly, so you don't have to remember numbers. I'll also put it in the description underneath. Uh, yeah, it's a good session. Let's see, hey, if you get all of them in seven minutes, you rest for the remainder, and then we crack on from minute seven to minute 14. Okay, so if you're really fast, then fantastic. I'm talking to you now. Um, if you're good, let's stretch them out. I'll demo everything and we'll get going, all right? If you're good, grab a band, grab a stick, whatever you have in your hand. Start up with the shoulders. Take your time. It's early. <laughs> Body's still waking up. So take your time. So I filmed these a day in advance, so I'm a day ahead of you. So, this is Saturday, but it's Sunday. So it's Saturday morning, and I'm about to do this. <laughs> right, one arm at a time, round you go. Just try and keep the shoulders squared. Keep those abs on. And keep going. The gyms in England have been given the, the date, I think it's 25th. So I would suspect, given the Wales are a little bit behind, maybe second week of August, maybe? Which would be nice. So those of you who've got equipment and kit, I just ask that nearer the time, a couple of days before we open, just drop it down, I can clean it up, and then we'll get going. For those of you who aren't members, give me a shout. Slide into my DMs. <laughs> Keep going with the shoulders, a heavy shoulder day. Yeah, go. Uh, contact me. If you've been doing these workouts and you're not a member, come in for a free taster. And uh, yeah, meet me in person. Slap me for this workout. Uh, press the position. Right foot, chest up, and onto the left. Keep going. Should be a little bit looser after that stretch session, especially around the hips. Keep going. Squeeze the chest up as you go. How long does this workout take? Yeah, this workout's just under 25 minutes, so you're going to get a lot done, a lot of reps, a lot of volume in 25 minutes. Not bad for Sunday. Right. Squeeze the chest up. Maybe the hips, you may have seen my post on Instagram. If you can do this for two minutes, it's great. You can choose any exercise or any uh, stretch to do. Try this one. Okay, grab your toes, squeeze them up, create some movement, try and tilt the tailbone, keep going, just stay on the midfoot. Those of you who are doing this session who live in London, just have to go to Cardiff. Right, how are you doing? So shoulders, legs, groin, hips opened up, hamstrings. So down you go. Reach out to one side, dig the shoulder in. Twist the chest up. Hands in on the other side. Open up the shoulders. 
Now get it done, you got up a twist, lift the chest, keep your bum up in the air, keep moving. And again, side to side, in your own pace, a couple more times. Again, what's happening is you're either rocking off 
your midfoot, you're falling forward onto the balls of your feet, and the pressure therefore is going into, those, into the quad in the area there. So think of those feet, take your shoes off if you want to. So if you're dropping forward there, that's a lot of pressure there. Hinge, arch goes back to the wall behind you. Hands out for a counterbalance. Grip the floor. Imagine, I said this to a client bit. You're standing on an on a open newspaper. Spread the newspaper apart. Imagine you're, you're there. Imagine you're ripping the newspaper down the spine. That's how much of the torque and tension you've got to create, okay? You squeeze it wide as you can, throw the hands up. There you're in squats. 60, 40, 20. It's a lot. Leg raises and air squats again. So it's only three exercises. Mountain climbers. Pretty. Uh, alternate. It's like you're playing tucks. Abs on. You alternate. So you start with one leg up. Abs are nice and tight. And you swap it. Now you've got to keep the shoulders over the hands. That's a 60 second challenge, do as many as you can during that 60 seconds, okay? So, we'll get cracking. <laughs> okay, this first set, seven minutes, 80, 40, 60, 30, 40, 20. All right? So 80, 60, 40 tucks, 40, 30, 20 leg raises. <laughs> right, seven minutes, okay? Now the glider tucks don't have a throw control. Alright, you've got to feel these abs, alright? Um, you stop and reset at any point, don't try and keep up with me. If you're faster than me, fantastic. You know, go for it, get stuck in. Um, yeah, form, form, form every time, especially with this number of reps, alright? Seven minutes, you ready? It's Sunday, come on, let's get this done. Seven minutes, 25 minutes and we're done, alright? Right, here we go, three, two, one, seven minutes, 80 reps. So my track record of counting. Control. I'm on ten. <laughs> right. Keep those abs in. Keep those hips down. Take your time. Keep the shoulders over your hands. I'm on twenty. Take your time. Keep those abs in. Smooth guys, don't let the hips lift. 30. <laughs> right, keep going. Right, I'm halfway at 40. Arms fatiguing. Shoulders fatiguing slowly.
Full extension first. You're not hammering through them at all. Slow. Full extension. Do not rush these at any point. You have to get those out of the way you have. There's no point in doing a mountain climb hill with a glider. Control. Focus on those abs. Shoulders are fatiguing. Keep that rhythm, guys. Keep counting your reps. I'm going to lift you all the way away from 60. <sighs> Keep those abs working hard. Oh. Right, we are coming up to the four minute mark. Remember your seven minutes. If you're into these leg raises, hold tension. Little down, back in. If you're on your second round of leg raises, you're doing 30 reps. Keep moving guys, my abs are fatiguing, hip flexors don't feel, just shake them off. Keep that bend in the knee, keep the back in. Keep them going. Alright, I've got 10 more and I'm the 30, hip flexors are screaming. Keep it going guys. Rhythm, smooth. Just keep holding that tension. Do not rush. Slow it down if anything. I can't see you, but I'm telling you to slow it down. Whew. Where are we at? We're coming up to that first five minute mark. Okay. I'm into my 14. Go ahead and touch. There we go. Full extension. Don't have a through. Full extension. Keep going. Keep those shoulders stacked well over those hands. Keep going guys, you're gonna have to stay on this. Keep that rhythm. Keep it going. Where are we at? Five minutes, 30 seconds left. Whew. Feel the shoulders. Keep that rhythm going. Slow, control. Six, three, seven, three, eight, three, nine, thirty. 
Keep it going, guys. Keep that rhythm. 55. 57. 58.
You have 60 seconds. Don't pressure. These are mountain climbers. One at a time. Your leg doesn't go until you reach full extension. Keep that rhythm. 80 squats is a lot. 
Ora di anche come adesso, eh? Apri. Right then, you got 3 minutes and 45 seconds in. Just a ruin your day. Okay, these are my last few reps. Keep counting yours. Keep going at your own pace. Okay, you're at four minutes. Three minutes to go. Your second phase, 30 reps. Control. You're not bouncing off the floor. You're fighting every inch of these. Take your time. Keep that low back in. Nice and active with those abs. Like I said, bend the knee a fraction further. Small range of movement, doesn't matter. As long as you feel those abs. Alternate if you want to. Down the floor, and alternate, right? It's the other way, isn't it? It's that. <laughs> oh, good. Four. 
Keep breathing. Bring my heart rate down. Okay. Right, if you're ready, it's in a pressing position. Find the right foot. Oh, legs and arms like jelly. Chest or shoulders back. Lengthen out as much as you can. Gently shift your weight forward and back and try and open up your hip. Tuck it under when you're ready. Sit right back into the stretch. Left hip flexor, twist into your right heel. Tailbone to the ceiling and keep those ribs down. So just sink into the stretch. Give yourself a few seconds. Your other side. So big step forward <laughs> like jelly. Okay, gently shift your weight forward and back, chest up, lengthen up as much as you can. Try and keep that back leg straight. Okay, same again. Tuck them under, right hip flexor, twist into that left heel. Stretch out as much as you can if you can and hold tension. Tailbone to the ceiling, just try and keep your ribs down so you can't hold the tension through those out. Straddle position, bend the one leg in at 90 degrees. You're going to lean over the bend leg, so right or left, whichever one suits you. So twist towards it, so rotate towards it. Try and keep your right hamstring down to the ground and hinge into it as much as you can. Right, a little bit harder now. Same bent leg, 90 degrees. Okay, same again. This is tough. So just hinge slightly, 
your tank slightly, it doesn't take much, it doesn't take much at all. Okay, back it off. Straddle position, other leg start with a slightly easier one. So bring the foot in, hinge over, try and keep this leg down on the ground. A few seconds. Okay, tough one now. So 90 degrees. Try and get a 90 degree bend right. Rotate towards that bent leg as far as you can. Do not push this one. A few seconds. Keep holding. Sorry, come on. Horrible. Right, slowly over your feet. Okay. Tuck your fingers under your toes. Drive up through those heels. Chest up, tailbone to the ceiling. Try and extend those arms and uh, the, uh, the legs as much as you can. Okay, bend the knee, back it off. Drive through. Tailbone to the ceiling, chest up. Okay, down you go. Relax fully. Breathe into it. Gently shift your weight from side to side. Relax the head, relax your neck. Right, one vertebrae at a time. So make sure before you go anywhere, your weight is on the midfoot. You're not on the heels, okay? If you push your bum back, instead of rolling from the spine, you take all pressure off. So stay on that midfoot, grip the floor. One vertebrae at a time. Lower back first, midfoot. Keep your weight forward. Take your time. Shoulders last. And chin. And you back down. Chin first. Shoulders. Midfoot pressure. One vertebrae. Over you go. Until you're in full flexion. Take your time. And slowly on the way up. So lower back first. Midfoot pressure, mid back, chin stays down, shoulders roll, you got it. Hands in the small of your back, squeeze them open, pinch the elbows together as much as you comfortably can. Okay, loosen them off one more time. Grab hold of your other wrist, open up, squeeze them open, keep the shoulders down. Keep squeezing. Job done. Uh, fantastic. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I did. Kind of feel like I've got a rhythm back. I feel like I'm thinking less about it and just kind of getting stuck in and enjoying it a bit more. Um, the idea of this was just to build that habit again. Get you back into a routine. Now I'm not expecting you to do seven days every single week, but what I am going to do is I'm going to keep pushing out these free videos. I'm going to keep doing them because I'm really enjoying them. I'm getting great, great feedback from you guys. I hope you are enjoying them too. So uh, for the remainder of however long we're in lockdown, it doesn't sound like it's going to be long. I'm going to carry on doing the free workouts. Um, I'm going to post them on YouTube. I will let you know. Obviously, I won't be doing one a day because seven days every single week is too much, but there'll be a variety. I may just do a kettlebell workout for those of you who are kettlebell home. I'll do a barbell workout. I'll do a band workout. And of course, I'll vary it up massively. So I give you alternatives. So please stick with me. Keep doing this. Um, I certainly am. Um, feel better already for it. Uh, body stiff, but in a good way. But look, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it's been a good laugh, actually, despite just talking to a camera on my own. Uh, guys, well done. Honestly, amazing. Well done. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, yeah, until the next one.